Hello everyone, it's Roid Man, and welcome to another Let's Play, which is a game I've never have touched before, so this is going to be more of a blind Let's Play. And what game is that? Well, even the game doesn't even know what it is. Of course it is on the PlayStation 2. And it's a game called Scalar, trademark. Check your memory card. 2004, Take Two Interactive Software, and Artificial Mind and Mil Movement Incorporation, Global Star Software, and a bunch of lizards. A2M. So, from research on what from the publishers of who made Scalar. They made a lot of those movie slash TV show video games, so my hopes are not too high with this game. Because with my history with those games, I don't really like them. But since this is more of a platformer and have no connections to TV shows or movies, I have nothing to fear, right? Well, let's find out when we start a new game. before he ruins everything. So, apparently we were being interrogated, we got turned into a lizard, and apparently there's other lizards, and then there's this person named Boot Licker, Boot Breath, Boot Camp, I think? So far, story to unclear. Weird dreams. 
Imagine having weird dreams, especially when you're a lizard. So, looks like we have control of our camera. X is our jump button. Square is our attack button. Triangle does nothing. And circle is our tongue attack. Ooh, wow, the controls are a little bit slippery there. But it looks like we can break a lot of the stuff, so... One thing I usually like to do with these platforms Farmers is explore a little bit and see what the heck I'm supposed to be even looking for. Also, what the heck is this anyway? Uh, can I use circle on you? Nope. Yes, the tongue attack is a lot faster, so that's at least good. So let's just get a lot of more of these just so we have them. Don't know what these orbs are for, so that is something I don't know. On vines, X or XX to jump over obstacles. Okay, you give us a tutorial. It's not even on the basic controls. Okay. So XX to jump. So it looks like we are just on a vine, so that's at least good. Don't know where this vine will lead us, but oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna fall for that. I am too experienced with... Oh, I should have done jumping there. Oh well. Okay, so... We got explosives! So, some of these we'll definitely want to keep a distance from. Let's see what you say here. Use circle to destroy objects from the distance. The tongue attack. Uh, thank you. Which will blow up a lot of this for us, so that's at least good. Oh, looks like we got enemies. And we can easily use the tongue attack here just to attack them. I am not going to use the other terminology for it. But yeah, I have no problems. And okay, camera, work with me here. If you're, going, if you're going to put me in combat, you got to be in the direction of where the enemy is. I don't think it, these points really do matter. I do want to grab these blue things because they seem important. But yeah, let's just blow that up. And looks like we have a... Vitaloids will help you recover one health point when you've been hurt. Okay, so those are the blue things. And now we have the platforming section. Let's see how good we can do with platforming. Use your claw to defeat this enemy. Claw attack, and then we have a three hit combo. So let's see how well we can do this. Oh god, explosive! So yeah, we were able to take out that enemy, and there is some vitaloid for us in case we got to take it out. But let's just take, can I? Yeah, let's take out those cr critters right there. I don't trust the explosive. And let's take out this explosive. Oh! <laughs> uh, that creature got yeeted into the water. I don't believe we can swim, so that's a disappointment. Climb up this platform. XX to grab the platform edge, and then X to climb on it. Thank you. Ooh, more explosives. So what if I do? Of course you hit the one thing that will blow them all up. Thank you. Nothing really important over here. Let's see, what do you have to say? The orange floating elements are cloakies. It looks like they can become useful later. Good to know. Okay, so let's... Ow. Okay, so we do have that three hit combo. Let's just get these cloakies here. Now where the heck are we going? Honestly, I could have ignored them. Oh well, let's just blow up this thing. So let's blow this thing up. There we go. If they do are supposed to come in important later, I should be collecting them. Okay, let's blow that thing up. That'll blow up everything else. And what collectible do we have here? Tell me good old game. These are 10 crystal gems in every level. We're 500 cloakies each. Collect them to unlock artwork in the gallery system. 
I am not going out of my way for this unless it, unless, unless it's necessary. And luckily for me, I have range over all these things. And yes, I'll take extra health. Thank you very much. And now time for more platforming. One, two, three. No, nope, blast it! Oh, please tell me I have like a checkpoint somewhere. I will accept that checkpoint. Thank you very much. And it doesn't look like we run on live, so that's at least good. That there is no live system. Jump, jump. Hey, hey, hey. You know what? I'll accept that death. Just for that thing. But it looks like we can basically... Yeah, we do have unlimited lives, so I don't have to worry about... I don't have to worry about losing too much or being way too careful. Which means I can do a trial and error thing if I need to. Blow that up. I hear a creature. Whoa! You are one ugly figment of my imagination. You aren't so easy on the eyes either, small, blue, and gruesome. You talk? Only to ugly blue creatures. Name's Leon. Leon? That was my father's name. Was. He left us when I was young. Oh, that's rough, kid. Kid? How about you call me Scalar? Really? This must be yours. Movie abuses lizard on set, activist protests at premiere. Twelve-year-old boy scaled Exoc building to save the lizards. Kid lives in tree for four months to protect unique lizard habitat. You're quite the troublemaker. Lizard freedom fighter, thank you. Oh, don't get me wrong, I like rebels. Especially lizard freedom fighting rebels. Hey, tell me something. When do I wake up from this freak show? Wake up? This is no dream. Okay. Have it your way. You're not a dream. Oh, no. Have it your way. I'm just a dream. I've got work to do. Okay, what's the here? X and left or right to change vines. And this time I will get this energy. Let's go here, and it looks like our protagonist Scaler is a lizard's rights activist. So that's good to know. I'm gonna go to the left to see if we can actually just utilize that. And we get rewarded for actually learning. I'm gonna use this just to grab that. That's probably the safest bet. So yeah, we actually do get stuff for actually learning from the controls. What I don't get from learning is jumping off the edge. Let's try that again without jumping into the water. So, we already got our it collectible item here. So, one thing we do have to keep in mind is that these things up here do have to be jumped for. Oh. Oh, okay. We definitely got to be careful on that because this looks like these sections are going to be trial and error. Especially that ending point. Oh, now you tell me how to double jump. To jump over large distances. Okay, let's see how well this works. One, two. One, two. And one, two. Um, where are y'all holding? Hmm, interesting. Oh! Okay, I see how that works. Now that I know how you work, I want more collectibles, so... Come on, fly, fly into the spike. I do believe the spike does hurt you if you go, go walking into it, so we're not going to experiment with that. Let's just blow up that bomb here. And, wow, only one cre creature died from that. Nope, not today. I really just want to blow that creature up. There we go. Come on. 
There we go. Let's blow up those creatures now. Hmm. Okay, so can I just... Okay, where can I... There's no spike plan for me to get you to. And, oh, we just caught your attention, haven't we? Yeah, the only spike plant that I see here is the one that's way over there. So we're going to have to basically... Yeah, we basically have to get that to the spike plant. I do want to see what, what all these have for collectibles. I know there is only five of those things. But the fact is this. I don't know what this currency is for or what these orbs are for. All I know is that they're collectibles. One, two, three! Oh god, nope. Okay, tongue attacks do not work on these guys. But they do have a certain fighting skill. Okay, I see two things. Uh, are you friendly or... You seem friendly. She's mine. Now listen and listen good. Don't you even think about Jack and my repodactyl. Hear me? Relax. I don't care about your repo repo baloney. I'm just killing time until I I wake up. Trust me. You're never going to wake up. Okay. Maybe I'm not dreaming. Maybe maybe this is real. Oh, it's as real as they come. Get used to it. You're still just one more speck of dust trapped here on the most pathetic plane of the multiverse. I'm no speck of dust. I can do anything. Really? I bet you can't even rescue that lizard egg. Piece of cake. I'll be back in no time. Egg in hand. Press triangle to talk to Leon. Um... So there is that over there. I do want to see what's over there, but... I'm just going to say this and let's end it off here. Next time on Scalar, we'll be going after that lizard egg. <laughs>